As the new dean of medicine, I'd like to personally welcome all of our new employees and ask, why the hell do you want to come back? Tired of surfing. He hasn't changed. And neither has the job, right? We still get to do crazy crap. Save people's lives instead of just their noses. About that? About the crazy stuff? Here we go. He's gone from ally to enemy. He has no choice. He's the boss now. He has to be professional. He has to base his decisions on what's best for the entire hospital. We can't take it personally. I couldn't have said it better myself. You did. I'm just reading the notes on your desk. He also wants us to spy for him. Not spy. I'm trying to keep House out of prison. To do that, I need to know what he's doing and planning. Spy. spy. Come on, guys. I am your boss. You do have to treat me appropriately. But it doesn't have to be awkward and weird. Outside of work, I still consider us all friends. Glad you feel that way, because I do have a favor to ask. I told House I couldn't come back until next week. He said he understood completely, and then I was fired. So. <clears throat> Since I have my kids for the next two days, I need a babysitter. No. Male patient went into V-fib, but shows no signs of heart disease or any other symptoms for that matter. What is he doing? It's hard to say. I spent a month in solitary. You don't think I can keep this up all day? I have a headache. Could you just lower your voice? Jason Carver back! Want me to pick up an ice cream cake? I also think the Taub has brought his little Taubets in to work with him today. Why would he do that? Because I didn't give him time to do anything else. And then I started wondering who'd be sappy enough to watch them for him. They're not here. What? I just came for a chat with a friend. What's that I smell, friend? I understand your confusion. I was eating a baby for lunch, and... I have a massive migraine. Will you please just go away? Well, you should probably lie down and rest. Yeah, I was trying to. Oh, there is one more thing. If you ever hear me mention anything about wanting kids, please feel free to punch me in the liver. Why? <laughs> like Satan's alarm clock. What's House up to? He hasn't asked me for anything. He's been incredibly well behaved. He's doing his clinic hours. That is a sign of concern. And you know him as well as I do. He needs to constantly establish he's the alpha dog. He's got his team back. He's got his office back. He's got everything he needs. You really believe that? He's content. I don't want to let House sabotage himself by sabotaging me. And I need your guidance and your trust to do that. <laughs> no, no, no. Cuddy had a problem with House. She came to me. Wanted to vent me. How did that turn out? You have a problem with House? Deal with it. Or find someone else who can. He's in too good of shape. I need to get him to the point he was at last night. Don't look at me, but if you want to. Cute. I didn't mean physical stress. Don't you guys think this is irresponsible? It's like you getting two women pregnant at the same time. I just mean the part about the odds of it happening. They had to be incredibly high, and if we induce V-fib, odds say that we'll be able to revive him, but there's always a chance we can't. It's extreme and reckless. That's house, so you get used to it. Or I fire you. Look what I found. Kitty Winkies. Wonder who they belong to. I mean, my kids. No, I genuinely wonder who they belong to. I need a DNA sample. I'm not letting you DNA test my kids. I already did. The swap's for you. Fine. If you don't mind paying a fortune in child support for some other guy's kids, no skin cells off my cheek. His heart rate. If you couldn't find a babysitter, get over it. You're gonna get us killed. She thinks I'm a prostitute on her turf, showing weakness to what gets you killed. Why would you think you're a prostitute? I'm gonna dump with a guy almost twice my age. 
What else are you going to think? How old do you think I am? You got at least a trillion cells. You're going to misplace one of them eventually. Sorry about yesterday. The house was like the child catcher from Chitty Chitty Bang Bang. Why is he so obsessed with my kids being my kids? Because he sees insecurity, and when house senses weakness, he pounces. And because his insecurity is the fact that other people can have faith and don't have the obsessive need for physical proof. Also, he started a betting pool on which kid is yours and which isn't. <laughs> An entire hospital betting on the legitimacy of my kids. It's great to be back among friends. I'm not the bad guy here. I'm betting on them both being yours. I would have donated the money to charity 